Hiya, I'm Trisha and I'm one of the fourth year medical students at Nottingham University and my first day feels like absolutely ages ago but I think I've learnt so much over the last few years that actually would have been really helpful to have known before starting medical school or you know like in the first few weeks where you're still settling in and finding your feet so I'm going to share some of these tips with you today and I really hope that they help. First and foremost I think the most important realisation that I've had is that it is impossible to know everything about everything and sometimes when it comes up to exams it's easy to feel disheartened if you think that you're not going to get through it all or if you're having to prioritise more important things and leave certain things out, don't worry, it happens to everyone and it's all part of the process and learning to prioritise is something that is an important skill to have anyway. So don't feel bad if it means that you're doing certain topics less thoroughly than you would have hoped to. Um, it's natural and it's going to happen, so don't worry. The second thing is that I wish I'd known is that it is really, really unnecessary to buy textbooks before the first day of medical school. And I know that everyone says this, but it's really, really true. So make sure that you don't go to medical school with a big bag of textbooks because the second years or the people in the year above you are an absolute fountain of knowledge in terms of which textbooks to buy, which are the recommended ones, which are the actual recommended ones. They might not necessarily be the same and they can also sometimes lend you their copies or point you in the right direction of where to find them second hand and cheap. Um, and a lot of the books actually you will find in the library and this is a great way to start, kind of try and test them out before you then go out and buy a copy. But you really don't need to have them on your first day of medical school. The third tip is to keep a routine of the things that you love doing. You really do need all your hobbies and family and friends and loved ones in order to get you through. So it's really important to make sure that you have things to look forward to in the evenings and the weekends and keep that routine going because the cliche is medicine is a marathon and not a sprint, but it really does hold true. So that's super, super important. The last thing I wish I'd known before coming to medical school is what type of learner I was because I didn't really have a particular set learning style really but I've now come to know that I'm a visual learner so that means that I need to sort of see concepts drawn out as like pictures or diagrams in order for them to really stick and so for example if you're an auditory learner you can really take advantage of that and perhaps take a dictaphone into your lectures um, ask the lecturer for permission and then you can listen back to them as revision or if you know that you like to learn in kind of bite-sized chunks you can start making little flashcards for each lecture um, as the year goes on so I think that's something that would have been really nice to know before medical school started that's it for now I hope that these tips are really helpful and good luck for your first day